Hi, my name is Jeff Montes de Oca. I'm a professor of sociology at UCCS, and I want to talk to you a little bit about one of my favorite classes to teach here. It's called Critical Analysis of Capitalism. This is a class about the effects of capitalism on democracy, the environment, people, and communities from a generally Marxist perspective. And I say generally because we'll mostly be reading Marxist scholars, but well, a few, a few aren't Marxists. The class is organized in some broad areas. First, we're going to define what is capitalism. Then we're going to talk about its historical development. We'll focus on some different topical issues. And finally, we'll look at the way in which capitalism impacts real people in their everyday lives. Now, you might wonder why a Marxist cl class about capitalism. Well, capitalism is the economy that, uh, that most of us experience, and therefore we live in capitalist societies. And we'll talk about why that is in the class. But capitalism itself is profoundly crisis prone and actually not good for most people, whether that is basic economic crises, such as the growing disparity in wealth throughout most capitalist nations right now, environmental crises, and we see that playing out in global warming, uh, political and social crises, and we talk about a variety of ways in which that is playing out in the world right now. These crises create uh, a world that is very unstable, and then state violence is needed to manage these crises. And so that's something else that we will be focused on in this class. So what happens in this class? Well, my teaching is guided by a Brazilian scholar by the name of Paulo Freire's idea of critical pedagogy. And what that means is students take a lot of leadership in this class. You're not going to have me lecturing at you in this class. So before class, you're going to read about a book a week. It's a lot. Also, for undergrads, they're writing about a book review a week as well. In the classroom, it's a seminar. That means we sit in a circle and we discuss and we have intensive discussions of the readings. And students are going to be leading those, uh, those discussions, or I should say facilitating the discussions. So what are we going to focus on? As I said, we begin, we spend four weeks reading three books that define capitalism. We look at capitalist patriarchy, we study racial capitalism, critical ecology, border migration and militarism, the white working class, welfare and welfare states, and also drug dealing as a type of labor. The assignments in this class, and I'm saying it again, we're reading about a book a week, so it's a lot. You know, again, undergrads are writing, you know, a book review, weekly book reviews. You're going to facilitate two class discussions. We also have public sociology projects. Basically, the idea of this is your job is to take the information and ideas that are debated intensely in the classroom and translate those to broader publics outside of the classroom. And it's really up to students to, to decide how they want to do that. And of course, class participation is incredibly important to this class. So the skills you're going to learn in this class, communication and analytical skills. Employers say the most important skill for that they want to see in uh, college graduates is communication skills and you're going to get a lot of that and that'll develop your analytical skills with all of this reading your other classes and other things going on in your life you're really going to develop a lot of time management skills in this class you'll learn historical materialism right a marxist perspective on the world that we live in you're also going to learn tremendous leadership skills in particular dialogue and emotional intelligence so I hope that gives you a sense of what this class is like. If this is something that would interest you, I also hope you sign up for it because this is a lot of fun and an incredibly, incredible learning experience.